Today, I'm going to be showing you guys how you can use this Creative Mark proportional divider. Now, this divider is made out of aluminum, it's nice quality, and the scale on it will move really easily. These kinds of proportional dividers are typically used from anyone who's doing cartography to architecture to illustration, or if you just want to scale up or down your reference photo or your real life still image that you're working from. So I'm going to be focusing on the line side of this proportional divider today. Um, it does have a circle side, and it, some proportional dividers will come with other markings on the opposite side. But those are really more for people who are interested in cartography or architecture. So for our purposes, the line side is going to do what we want. The first thing I'm going to look at here is these little scale lines on the side of it. You can see that my little knob right here has a line on it that you can match up with different scales on the line side of this. You can move this up and down to adjust the scale that you want. This bottom one right here is your one-to-one -one ratio. So if I set it, all I have to do is tighten it up so that it doesn't move up and down at all. And then I can open this up. And no matter what, no matter what I move these two points to, these two sides will always be at a one-to-one -one ratio. So if you want to exactly go from your reference image over here, I have this little still life printed out, and get an exact one-to-one -one ratio where you're going to be sure that like your oranges are the same size as your bowl, you'll be able to do that with this. If you want to use any of the other notches that are on here, it's easy. Just come back to this resting point, open up your knob again, and slide it up to whatever proportion that you might want. So if I take it up to the number two right here and tighten it back up again, I can then open this up and I will have a one to two ratio that I can use to either scale up my reference image or if I flip this around and use the other side and then get my proportion taken again, I can scale down my image.